like Super Mario one. The Toad one. Blue Mario. But I did find this from the Sonic line. Check this big figure. It's called Big. I'm not even sure what this character is, but I like it. And it's only 10 bucks, so. I'll take this one. But, uh, yeah, there's no Hot Wheels, there's no Matchbox, there's no Tech Picks here. Oh, I like these little ones too. These are five bucks. This is 10, this is five. 10, five. Just spend a little more. But, ooh, I like this. Okay, next time. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Good thing is like really empty too. It's been empty for a while. At the Walmart right now, and it's like they just stocked up on these um Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the jumbo ones, the giant ones, original 1989 figures. I mean, the original ones are going for like so much right now. It's crazy. But uh, these are like I guess like reissues. Yeah, they're only 25 bucks. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna take one of these. Ah, oh, but they only have Michelangelo. They got three Mikeys and three Leos. And then they got three Leos and a fuller over here in the one. So maybe they're gonna stock up more. I'm not sure though. Oh man, I gotta take one of these. These are so nice. It's pretty cool. It comes with a little sword. This is how they would come like back in the day it's just like reissues and they haven't really like stocked up on the just like the regular figures here so i don't know if they're gonna stock up but uh yeah i think i gotta take my jumbo ones giant ones they're pretty sick Let's see the back. yeah see they got all four turtles my favorite one is Raphael. so Oh man, that would have been so cool to just take the ref right now, but if I have to choose between one of these two, I'd have to pick Leonardo, the leader. That's pretty sick. Man. Walmart right now, and it's just like completely dry on the Hot Wheels. There's a lot of five packs though. It's like they put out a lot of five packs, but the only new one that I see is this one. Demolition, oh, Demo Destruction. I already like that one right there. That one is the Cruise Bruiser. I do like that cast. I do collect that cast. But uh, I did see that there's like some that are smashed. I mean, I, I guess it's for like the demolition, but um, yeah, that's like two cars that are smashed, and all you're gonna get is pretty much three cars, but I don't know. <clears throat> it's okay. Some new matchbox. Nothing really that cool except for like a. I did find a, a Corvette and a National Parks car. Where did I leave this? Oh, here. Yeah, I got the 70th anniversary Lightning National Parks. And that Corvette, the 2020 Corvette. Now I was going through these um, Tony Hawk Hot Wheels, like tech decks, I guess. And um, I found this Star Wars one. It's pretty nice. That Boba Fett. Yeah, it's actually pretty cool. It's, it's a really nice image. Did like this one. And um, yeah, there's, there's some pretty cool ones here, like this one has that uh, Roger Dodger on it. It's a pretty cool image. This one has the Diora. Yeah, these are pretty cool, but I don't know if I wanna like get really into them. Last time I took a couple of these type. I took the Bone Shaker one and the, the one with the Cruise Bruiser. And there's a Cruise Bruiser. Oh, check it out. This is the one I took. The Bone Shaker. And, oh yeah, this one too. 
than this one. Got a bunch of different toys and like different stores. I did find this ET. This is the 40th anniversary. Elliot with ET. Elliot and ET. And this little bike. You barely kind of see that right there. It does look pretty sick though. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna keep this in the box. Yeah, most of my Funko Pops, I just keep them in the box. I like how it displays in the little window. And I'll probably get like a little protector for it too, so. But uh, yeah, these are pretty sick. Um, I have six different ones. The only ones that I've seen are the the Elliot one, the Gertie one, and the Elliot with ET. But I haven't seen the just the ET ones. Which I think are pretty cool. I think I want to get that um, ET in the robe or ET with flowers. Yeah, but these are pretty sick. I just came back from um, Universal Studios like a week ago, so there's a lot of ET stuff over there too. But yeah, this is pretty cool. I found this one at the Walmart, and uh, yeah, I'm just gonna keep that one in the in the box. Probably even get a protector for it. Also got a chopper from uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. It's a Jack Pacific. I've been getting really into this uh, toy company too, Jack Pacific. Well, I like these smaller toys, like the Mario ones and the, the Sonic ones. I'll open this one right now. I got this Godzilla. This is my second Super 7 figure. Check out that big Godzilla logo. And this is the Godzilla from 1957. That's pretty sick. It's a reaction figures. It's got the big tail and everything. And it's kind of like a little, not really like goofy face, but um, yeah, it looks pretty classic though. I don't know, I just like the whole packaging and everything. And um, yeah, I'm gonna keep this carded too because um, I have my uh, my first uh, Super Seven was the the Slythe I got from as a, as a gift for my wife. And uh, yeah, I wanna add this one too to the collection. But I just, I like the whole packaging and just, it looks really awesome with the whole the name, the whole artwork and everything. And these are some other ones from that same line. This was the only one that I saw, so I got this one at Target though. But they also have Godzilla 54. It's the one I got, 57. The Mecha Godzilla. They have Rodon. That one look, must look really nice. Mothra. This is the one I, I would like to get. And Jet Jaguar. Yeah, it's pretty sick. It's all like black and white. And I got this uh, Sonic the Hedgehog. This figure is called Big. Also from Jack Specific. It's a pretty big figure. Got the target and I'll, I'll open that one right now. I got another one of these um, Garbage Pro Kids figure old bag clip. This, this, I had Brainy Janie and the double Heather. It's very nice. Let's see which one I get. I'll open it right now. And I got a few Matchbox too. This one I want to keep carded because uh, I like the, the card. For the seven years of Matchbox. And this one's the 2022 Ford F-150 Lightning. Like how it's the logo on the truck and everything. Looks pretty cool. And I like this card. I mean, it really stands out from like, like a regular card. I'll spot these right away. And another one that I had from that same line was this um, Dodge Charger. So I'm gonna keep these two carded. And I'll open these two. Got the National Parks Ford Bronco and the 2020 Corvette. Got another National Parks here. Actually, I actually have a few National Parks already, so I'm gonna like keep that as a collection. And I also got some of these Hot Wheels Skate. I got the Cruise Bruiser. Open this one right now too. And the Bone Shaker. 
mean, these are really cool, but um, just like the whole like the card and everything is just like a little much to store it. So I'm just gonna open it right now. And I found this um Star Wars one, Hot Wheels Skate, the Boba Fett. I found this at Walmart. Just really like the the whole artwork and everything. Looks pretty sick. Yeah, I like the cars. Just like really, really big and takes up space so yeah i'm gonna open this one too it's pretty cool let me just open this up and um show me off from this um i was tripping out on this matchbox one seems like they put double the plastic in. the blister i guess it's like a double bl i haven't seen that before so let me just kind of check it out double blister yeah it's pretty cool national parks got the ford bronco actually I have another national parks over here too so I'll open it add it for the collection it's the plow this is actually pretty cool national parks Oh, they're all like that same color. Yeah, I think I'm gonna start a little collection on these. I got the 2020 Corvette. It's a really cool model. I do like this cast. This color is actually really cool. Black and white. That looks really nice. the corvette collection uh, i actually got a repeat on the damn garbage pill kids thing and i actually try to feel like because it has like a little cardboard inside so i try to feel like the bag but yeah i guess i wasn't really sure on it and i got the same one it's a little piranha the chopper it's pretty cool it's got a little articulation on the tail that's pretty much it. Not really in the, the mouth or anything, but it does have a little stand, so it's just pretty cool. Just to display it like that. And uh, this is actually the first um, Hot Wheels skate that I opened, so check it out the bubble fit. Like the artwork on it. And even the grip tape is like Star Wars with Hot Wheels. It does have like a little cheap grip tape. I think the tech thick ones are like a lot better but the boards are really cool does have um metal trucks yeah it's just, it's just not the same as like tech thick i think it's like tech thick is just way better quality than these um yeah they don't even like roll that good but uh, i like the artwork on that one and we got this one pretty cool image but i uh, mainly got this one for the the bone shaker check this bone shaker out i mean the wheels kind of suck but um it has like those track wheels but the car is really cool it's metal plastic base and it is a bone shaker so it's pretty cool this is a cruise bruiser tony hawk it's like the artwork on this one check it out tony hawk and i actually do collect this model so that's mainly why i bought these two and this is the board tony hawk this one's actually pretty cool oh it does have a different grip tape oh this one too yeah so i guess the Grip tips are all different, but I, I do like this this board, and they come with like little shoes too. So they're like little like rubbery plastic shoes. I mean, I guess they're like for your fingers, but um, I don't know. They're kind of they're kind of whack. Not really something that I'm into, but I just 
throw those away. Like the little sneakers. When this thing comes off. I don't even know for what. But um I guess. Yeah, I just like the quality of those. It's just not really good. I mean this one I got it mainly for the artwork. The Boba Fett, Star Wars. And the other ones I mainly got it for the cars that came with it. And oh yeah, I showed the little piranha. This one's the one that I really did like. It's a big figure. I'm not even sure what this character is from. I mean, I'm not really like. I mean, I remember Sonic from like the Sega games from back in the day. But I guess there must be like cartoons and. Well, I mean, like all these other games too. And um, yeah, so I'm not really sure on this this character but um the figure is actually really cool it's the really big figure really cool color it's light purple with like darker purple it's not much articulation but um it displays really well the arm does have articulation and the wrist too you can probably find some sort of pose or something and also the feet you can move them around pretty cool the tail a little bit too that's a pretty sick figure it's just like a really big figure it's called big and it came with these um little rings too the gold rings well that's pretty much it this little toy haul that i got something that i really like was this um elliot and et funko pop I'm not really like collecting a lot of Funko Pops, but I don't know, somehow I already have a lot of Funko Pops. And also this Godzilla figure. Reaction figures, the Super 7. It's that Godzilla 57. It's actually my second Super 7 figure. I like this big figure. This little piranha displays really well. Chopper got the National Parks Matchbox cars, the Corvette, another garbage pill kids, and these uh, hot whiskey. But I mainly really did, did like these um these Hot Wheels. Like how they just like came with the little boards. These boards. Well, that's pretty much it. Just the little toy haul that I got. Nothing that I want to show. Been buying like from different stores, like Target, Walmart, and I think that's it. Yeah, well, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys. Later.